Hello, welcome to the Angular Reactive Form tutorial series. In this tutorial series, we'll be using Angular Material for designing an Angular application. So, in this first video of the tutorial series, let's see how to install Angular Material into our Angular application. So, let's get started. Let's get started by creating an Angular project. So, I'll start by creating a new Angular project using ng-new. Let's name our project as Reactive. So now this thing it installs or it creates a new project. So I don't need routing for this project as of now. So I'll press no and CSS yes. So now that installs um, the packages and all. So now let's uh, move into our Angular project and do an npm start. Now this should run the Angular application. Project uh, up and running. You just go to your browser and refresh this thing. Now you should be able to see the reactive app which is up and running. Okay, so I'll just start by installing um, Angular material. From your command terminal, you need to do ng, ng add Angular material. Now this thing should add Angular material to your Angular project. Installing the packages. It's asking for a default theme, so I'm pressing yes for the Indigo one. Set up Angular material typography styles, okay, yes. Set up browser animations, yes. It's updating the package.json file as you can see on the screen. So now, once this thing is done, we should be able to use Angular material in our project. So now, once you have uh, this thing updated successfully, what we'll do is we'll try to put uh, one of the slider modules from Angular module from this Angular material in our project. Now go to your project, now open the app, app.html, remove all the HTML portions that you have in there. Now we'll add some HTML to render here. Now before that, go to your app module and import the math slider module once you imported the slider module uh, let's try to use it inside our html set the app.html let's paste it Now let's run our project. So now as you can see the Angular project is up and running. I'll just refresh the screen. Okay, there you go. And you should be able to see the Angular material slider. There you go. That means Angular Material is successfully installed in our application and we are using the Matt Slider module. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.